Hello there and welcome back. If you're a fan like me, you'll agree that In the Heat of the Night 1988 stands among the greatest TV series ever. So, how about joining me today? Grab a chair, settle by the campfire, and let's relive this fantastic show together. We'll journey through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who've left us and celebrating those who still shine. Ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. Carl Weathers played the character Chief Hampton Forbes. He was 40 years old when the TV series ran in 1988. Sadly, on February 1st, 2024, he left us due to atherosclerotic cardiovascular disease at the age of 76 in Venice, California. His passing deeply saddens us. Where are you now? I'm heading south. Old Highway 32 cuts through in about a quarter mile. It's meridian to the left. There's yeah. Mama and Papa, uh -huh. and yeah. then there is the daughter and the son, yeah. and then there's their daughter oh, and son. That's so, something. Right? Well, but that's Crystal Fox played the character Officer Luann Corbin. She was 24 years old when the TV series ran in 1988. Check it out. At 60 years old, she's rocking a fulfilling life, jam-packed with passions, right here in Tryon, North Carolina. But he is still my son. He ain't staying here. Now what you talking about? This is my house. You want me to leave too? Mama. Last time he was around, he stole from us, don't you remember? And then it dropped, and then I find out that Big Little Lies is nominated for Best Ensemble Cast. I was like, what is happening? It feels like a... Anne-Marie Johnson played the character Althea Tibbs. She was 28 years old when the TV series ran in 1988. Here she is, at a cool 64, chilling in Los Angeles, California, enjoying a happy life with family and friends by her side. You got my car. You can get away. Uh, uh, any of the cast members I'm in between, yeah. that is a solid, wonderful, well-greased machine. Yeah. Harriet, everyone is fabulous, Cindy. Carol O'Connor played the character Chief William O. Bill Gillespie in the TV series when he was 64 years old in 1988. It's with a heavy heart that I've got to tell you that on June 21st, 2001, he left us after a heart attack brought on by complications from diabetes at 77 in Culver City, California. We're really feeling the loss. We're back without a birth certificate. So I'm nobody. I'm not here. Well, whatever they want, but naturally as I proceed with the show, I'm, I'm, going, to, I'm going to try to give, give myself and the show Denise Nicholas played the character Harriet DeLong in the TV series when she was 44 years old in 1988. Check it out, at 80 years old, she's rocking a fulfilling life, jam-packed with passions, right here in Detroit, Michigan. Money to retain him, if you can do that. I can do that. Thank you. Um, which I loved, so... Uh, but truly, in my earlier years, uh, there really wasn't very much that I felt. Alan Autry played the character Captain V.L. Bubba Skinner. He was 36 years old when the TV series ran in 1988. Here he is at a cool 72, chilling in Shreveport, Louisiana, enjoying a happy life with family and friends by his side. Nobody. Why do you know it? Because I'm the man's friend, that's why. And we talk. And I'm telling you, if Eddie Laren said it, it was self-defense, it was self-defense go outside. Now, I know they're feeling their way too. I'm not going to demonize the CDC for that. They're trying to figure this thing out. It seems to be changing, but you know. Jeffrey Thorne played the character Sergeant Wilson Sweet in the TV series when he was 18 years old in 1988. Here he is at a cool 54, chilling in USA, enjoying a happy life with family and friends by his side. Well, young Sweet, what can I do for you? Thought you might like to see this photo. So I'm not that guy, I'm not like standing on the thing going, you know, black forever. I'm, not, I'm just like, I'm an American. I'm yeah, an old school, there. regular, Sesame Street American. Tanya Stewart played the character Aunt Etta Kibbe in the TV series when she was 41 years old in 1988. Here she is at a cool 77, chilling in Greenwood, Mississippi, enjoying a happy life with family and friends by her side. But it sure looks beautiful. Lord have mercy. I haven't seen Odessa. We'll snatch a child out of, a, out of a situation fast. I called him about a case just last year. Howard E. Rollins Jr. played the character Chief of Detectives Virgil Tibbs. 
He was 38 years old when the TV series ran in 1988. It's with a heavy heart that I've got to tell you that on December 8, 1996, he left us after AIDS-related lymphoma at 46 in New York City, New York. We're really feeling the loss. It's got to be perfect. Does Bubba know how to hit him and take him down? I want Bubba to do this. She's your wife, but she's my responsibility. Ways, how many times does it have to be said? Do you have to hear it before you'll listen? Don't. No. Hugh O'Connor played the character Lieutenant Lonnie Jameson in the TV series when he was 26 years old in 1988. Sadly, on March 28, 1995, he left us due to suicide at the age of 33 in Pacific Palisades, California. His passing deeply saddens us. Yeah, we'll, we'll take care of it. Huh? Well, if you don't, we might just stop by and make sure we do.